Hello, and welcome back to another episode of Berkeley TV! I'm your host, Alec. And I'm Kento. We are going to be looking at two topics today. One, a couple of our Berkeley community's New Year's resolutions. And two, the Rube Goldberg machine that Mr. Colt's 8th grade class has been working on. That sounds like a lot of fun. Let's get right into it. First, we'll be taking a look at some of our Berkeley community's New Year's resolutions. My New Year's resolution is to pass physics next year and f pass my assignments. My finals, they're a bit, they get a bit hard by the end of the year. And probably pass algebra, that, that, algebra two, two. That gets a bit hard sometimes, so. My New Year's resolution is going to be uh, getting at least 12 points in basketball game. My New Year's resolution is to be cooler than Jai. I want to get six back by next year. My New Year's resolution is to get even more alpha than I already am. Look at him. So, um, I don't have a New Year's resolution. Um, the concept of New Year's is a man-made aspect and um, it's I don't see why we should need to wait until New Year's to better ourselves, correct mistakes, and learn. So every day I try to have a New Year's resolution. Just, you know, it's an opportunity to start fresh every day. Do you want free house points or a free drink? Well, we have come up with a fun idea to get you either one. The Berkeley TV crew has come up with a new shout out system called BTV Shouts. In order to get one of these prizes, you must do one of the following. Help out a student or a teacher. This can be helping a fellow student in class or with homework, or going above and beyond the expectations of your teachers. But you cannot shout out yourself. If you feel that a fellow student has helped you in class or with your homework, feel free to email tv at berkeley.ac.th. Or for the teachers, if you feel as if one of your students has gone above and beyond your expectations, feel free to email us too. The way you will know if you have received a shout out is that you will be featured on an episode of Berkeley TV. Thank you for listening to this announcement, and we hope you all have a wonderful day. Whoa! I hope everyone completes their resolutions this year. Next up, let's take a look at Mr. Colt's Rube Goldberg machine. Alec, I'm confused. What is Rube Goldberg machine? Well, it is a machine that carries out a specific task in a super complicated way. And you build it by using lots of random materials like wood, string, dominoes, water, and other stuff like that. That sounds interesting. Let's have a closer look. So what we got the 8th graders doing is a Rube Goldberg project. It, it's kind of a culmination um, of finishing up chemistry and talking about energy and energy transformations and moving into the next step, which would be physics. So this is kind of a culminating project. Uh, you can see pulleys, we're talking about simple machines, and we've actually teamed up with the IT um, teacher, Mr. Ron, to really incorporate not only simple machines, but also simple electronics to continue this, uh, this concept of energy transfers and it can keep going, um, and this action-reaction pair that we've got going. Our machine is basically um, a machine with three um, simple machines and one wrecking ball. Uh, it's pretty visible over there, and uh, we think it will be done by today, and everything will be done by today. First, a ball will be knocked by a water bucket from here, and the ball will roll down this inclined plane that will knock over all these dominoes, and this will hit a ball, and it will knock over this platform, which then, this will activate a wrecking ball over here, and so when this wrecking ball activates, it will knock over this uh, micro bit here, and it will detect that it's been knocked over and a water pump will go there and the ball from a, um, a simple machine will go to the other projects. Wow, 8th grade did a really good job if you ask me. I agree. Anyway, that's all we have for today. Thank you for turning into Berkeley TV. And remember, we're the Berkeley Lions. Hear us raw.